dangerous San Fernando Valley chase has just ended in a spectacular crash with innocent people hit. Multiple vehicles are wrecked and a local neighborhood is stunned by the sudden and violent collisions. Eyewitness News reporter Eileen Frere is live in Van Nuys with the late breaking details. Eileen? And Mark and Michelle, a tow truck just arrived behind me here to pick up one of the vehicles damaged by the suspect. Now, police continue to search for that suspect, but they say they know who he is and where he lives. The white Mercedes sits where it came to rest at the end of a pursuit in Van Nuys. This is a named suspect. He is wanted already for human trafficking, so we know who he is. Police say officers were trying to do a felony stop when the suspect took off, leading police on a high-speed pursuit through residential neighborhoods. I heard a horrendous crash. The suspect sideswiped at least two cars here near Hatteras and Halbrandt. It was just that deep crushing sound of cars hitting. Police say a mom and her young child were inside one of the vehicles, a white Jeep. They were not injured, but the suspect lost control and ended up on the lawn of a home. He then took off running. It's really dangerous, the high speeds, uh, traveling in a small residential neighborhood, and there's people that are out and about. It's very dangerous. Now, LAPD also says that there was another collision involving an officer who was responding to this location when police say he hit an innocent driver's vehicle. It's not clear yet whether anyone was injured in that crash. We're still trying to get more details on that. In the meantime, the suspect, the search for him continues, but police say they, they know who he is and where he lives, so it's just a matter of time before he's in custody. Hello, I'm Mark Brown. Click the ABC7 logo to subscribe to our Eyewitness News YouTube channel.